Hey guys, so today I'm going to talk to you about some different Disney movies to watch on Netflix. Um, this could be, you know, you're looking for a good movie for your sibling or your child, or you just want to go watch and, you know, revisit some of your childhood favorite Disney movies. Um, so the first one I'm going to talk to you about is Pocahontas. Um, you know, it's the story about, you know, how... The English settlers come in, they meet the Indians, you know, Pocahontas and whatnot. And there's also a second movie, which I vaguely remember seeing this when I was younger. But I believe she actually goes to England with uh, Smith. So, so yeah. So there's they have one and two on Netflix. They also have one and two of Mulan. And I really liked Mulan when I was growing up because it was, like, all about empowering women and the music was always really good. Um, I can't really remember what the second one was about either, but that's on Netflix as well. Um, I believe... I don't, I can't remember if they get married or not, but they, they further that relationship between the two of them. Um, the next one is Emperor's New Groove. I always really liked this one when I was younger, and so did my brothers. Um, it's about a guy who basically goes to the Emperor and is like, please don't, you know, put whatever you wanted, some big, like, extravagant, like, water park or s something. He wanted to build on, build on top of this village, so he comes and talks to him, and he's like, hey, please don't do this, and they all kind of go, like, on an adventure, but Kronk is really funny, and so is the llama, um, but I really like this movie. The next one is Hercules. It's basically based off of, you know, your Greek story, but it's, like, the Disney version, um, it's really good. Good music as well. Um, I always really like the girl in it. And this one's good. The next one is Aristocrats. Aristocats. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I, I think I only saw this one like once. But I believe someone does get kidnapped. But it has good music in it. And if you're a big fan of cats, this is definitely for you. Um, the next one is Atlantis. I remember when this movie came out because Disney had really cool uh, Atlantis the Lost Empire toys, um, but I, I did like the film, and it's basically about them all going on an adventure to find, you know, the lost Atlantis, and they actually find it, and it's a pretty cool uh, movie, actually. They, they had a nice twist on it. So the next movie I'm going to talk to you about is Dumbo. This movie's older. I think it was made in like the 40s. It's also one of the shortest Disney movies I know of. It's only like 64 minutes. But this one is about a elephant who is made fun of because of his big ears. But it turns out with those ears he can actually fly. It's pretty cute. The next one is Walt Disney's Treasure Planet. This is based off of it's like Disney's version of Treasure Island. Um, it's set more of in a futuristic kind of like different worlds and space kind of thing. But it, it's it's good. Next one is Rescuers. Um, it's about kind of like um, like the UN and has mice in it. And they go looking for this girl. And I, I only saw this movie like once a long time ago. But I remember liking it. Uh, another one is The Sword in the Stone. This is a classic. It's based off of the book, and I actually read the book, um, but I, I saw the movie when I was a kid beforehand, but I really like the animation. It's really cute. I think my favorite part is, I think there were fish and different animals at a, different points in time, like, because of magic, and it's it's a really cute movie. And the last one I want to talk to you about is Robin Hood. This is a classic as well. It's the Disney version. He's a fox. It's your normal Robin Hood story, but it's really cute and it has good music as well. So I hope you found this movie video helpful and thanks for watching and please comment and like.